SDG stands for Sustainable Development Goals. It is a new project that started in 2016 and it will continue until 2030 by UN to transform our world. There is 17 goals which we need to improve and we focused on SDG 2 and SDG 16. SDG 2 stands for No Hunger, 795 million or 1 in 9 people in the world don't have enough food to eat. Some places are in extreme hunger because of civil war and many conflicts. One of the targets for SDG 2 is decreasing death and hunger or under 5 years old by malnutrition. In 2014, an estimate 158.6 million children under age of 5 were affected by malnutrition that the height, weight, and knowledge were lower than the average. Dropout rates of students are also exceedingly high due to hunger. The parts of the world most affected by the hunger in 2010 is Rwanda. At the same time, it is also one of the poorest countries that 90-95% to live on a day with only $2. By 15 years of civil wars since 1993 combined great poverty. Burundi is landlocked and has poor resources with undeveloped manufacturing. It extremely suffers from hunger. Less than one-third of Burundi's population has enough food to eat throughout the year. As a result, nearly 60% of Burundi's population decreased. There were many movements to improve the serious situation, such as donating basic food, money, and needs. They also improved education and schools where are teaching knowledge-free, free tuition, while fighting against hunger, it has been declined from 15 according to figures for 2000 to 2002 to 11% according to figures for 2014 to 2016. But more than 790 million people worldwide are still having lack of food. If the movement continues in this speed, Zero hunger targets will not completed by 2030, like Millennium Development Goals. Actually, in the world, there are enough food to feed everybody. But because of greed and desire of people who is wealth, poor are getting damaged. So our opinion is if the people treat equally, the speed of reducing hunger will be much faster.